Suppose we wish to have a program repeat a command until a condition is satisfied. This is possible under the repeat command on the TI-8384 calculators, and the purpose of this script is to demonstrate its use. For our demonstration, we shall have the calculator output positive even integers until the value of the counter supersedes 10, at which point the program will cease. And here's how this can be done. First, we're going to create a new program called repeat. So we will simply type in the word repeat as the name. Now the blinking A there means that the alpha lock is activated so that you will type uh, characters rather than numbers. So after we type the name in we hit enter that brings us into the program creation menu and we initialize our counter to start at zero. We call the counter I and we start it at zero. So we're going to hit program now and we're going to scroll down until we hit the repeat command. That's where we're going. Now we're going to repeat this next sequence of commands until I is greater than 10 and that we hit the second math to get to the inequality symbols. And that's what this line means. So the repeat command again is found under the program button and then under the CTL menu, the control menu. The command is structured so that a command is repeated until a specific condition is satisfied. So it is not going to repeat a command as long as the condition is true. It actually repeats a command until the condition is met. So be careful using this command. It is different from the while command, which will execute a group of commands if a condition is true. Now we're going to add 2 to our counter. And we're going to store that as the counter itself. So this particular setup for the counter will skip the odd integers because I start at 0 and I add 2 so I go to 2 and then I'll add 2 and I go to 4 etc. Now I'm going to also display this. So I'm going to hit the program button, go under I.O. and select display. And I'll simply just display the counter while the command is operating. Now I'll go under program and I will select end so that the program knows that this sequence of commands that I'm repeating ends under this uh, display command here. So now we're going to end the repeat command and we're going to quit the program editor and run the program to see if there are any bugs. So we'll go second mode to quit. We'll select program. We'll execute this program and here we can see the counter values being displayed up to 12. When the counter reached 12, 12 was bigger than 10 so the repeat command ceased to operate and the program was done after that. Notice that 0 is not printed to the screen because I added 2 to that counter before I had the display command execute. So only 2 to 12 are displayed. And this is how the repeat command works on the TI-8384 calculators.